Mm. What's happening? Welcome. Appreciate the person on that play, but I am with it. William, glad y'all going on to join a player. We got two women. We call them women. If they came out, they mama monkey with a monkey. We got two women in the Houston area who has been accused of multiple robberies in just four hours. So them babies been out here working. They've been out here working. Watch y'all back. Here we go. Only on Fox tonight, multiple law enforcement agencies are searching for two young women. They're accused of committing a string of robberies in three different counties in a span of about four hours. Fox 26's Randy Wallace joins us live from HPD headquarters downtown. Randy. Yeah, Anthony. Now, investigators say the robbers, ages 20 and 23, have no problem hurting somebody to get what they want. In a breaking bond report last month, we told you about... Look at them beautiful babies. Or oh, is that the same baby? 26-year-old Aubrey Donnell Davis. Miss Aubrey Davis had been arrested 30-something times. Damn. Oh, that's the same chick. So she gained weight, she lose weight, she gained weight, she lose weight. That, that's what's up. Did, did, damn it, did he just... Did he just tell us 36 times? Aubrey Davis had been arrested 30-something times. Davis had the most bonds we had ever seen, 16 in about a year's time. For this individual to have this many bonds in a year is astounding. Police say Davis and Tyra Dale Goff ran over a subway employee who chased after them following a robbery. They robbed the subway person. The subway person ran after them and got ran over. Off was the operator of the vehicle. Davis was the passenger. The 20-year-old Goff, who's been arrested more than 20 times. That baby got that big ass tattoo on her neck. I'm not saying people with um, tattoos on their necks is bad people. I just like to point out that they got tattoos on their neck. But hold on, go ahead. The 20-year-old Goff, who's been arrested more than 20 times, is now wanted in a string of robberies with this woman, Aaliyah Michelle Dews. Look at them. Look at them babies right there. Yep, yep, yep. These babies. It, with the, damn it, they look innocent. Dues has active warrants in Harris County for violent offenses. One involving a family member that she struck with a hammer, and then another one where she confronted a uh, her ex-boyfriend's uh, current girlfriend and fired a weapon at him and her. During a robbery in the Woodlands, police say the pair assaulted a woman at 6 a.m. as she walked into her job. They physically assaulted her, took her purse and a lot of other personal belongings. we jumping on the baby at 6 o'clock in the morning. In minutes, the women are seen using the victim's credit cards at multiple locations in Harris County. Three and a half hours later, the pair allegedly robbed an 81-year-old woman in Pearland. Taking her purse from her, striking her in the face and dragging her across the parking lot before people intervened on her behalf to help her. Authorities say these two women committed 10 felonies across three different counties in a span of just four hours. They're not afraid to hit somebody with a car. In the case in Pearland or whatever, they're not afraid to use physical force on an elderly person. In our, our case, our girl was in her early 20s where they were not afraid to blitz attack her, just her simply walking into her job. Now, if you come in contact with golf or dues, police say don't confront them due to their violent tendencies. Don't confront these beautiful babies. They got something for you like a car. Instead, call your local law enforcement agency or Crime Stoppers. Reporting live from downtown. I wonder how much Crime Stoppers is given to the peoples out here f for assisting in these um, in the apprehension of these two beautiful babies. Nah, that damn it. So we is arresting. We we catching and releasing. Is Houston um a democratic city? Is that a democratic city? It's a catch and release, obviously, because she done been arrested over thirty times. The other one has been arrested over twenty times. Um, on golf, that beautiful baby right there with that big ass throat tattoo on. Yeah, now, now, now you must really be like a pain freak to get like your throat tattooed and stuff. But y'all really don't care nothing about no dog on pain. Listen. Listen, these babies are not trying to hurt nobody. They just going through a little something with it. It was, um, hell, they may be going through postpartum. They could be suffering from mental illnesses, and we've been trying to get them help. Y'all know how the family be coming out. I'd hear any dog on the street. But hey, 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 man. Believe all women, and women is not harmful. Women is not a threat. This is the society that we live in. The society that we live in keep, keep trying to tell us, but I keep showing you something different. They keep trying to tell us that women is just harmless. They won't do nothing like that. But right here at the Willie Williams Show, I keep showing you, that's not true. <laughs> if y'all like what y'all just had, that's all. Give a play a thumbs up um, or one thumbs up in the share. We really do appreciate that right there. May y'all tell somebody about this pimping. I am out of here. Oh, keep your eyes peeled. Watch 23, 16, your 9. Y'all may run up on these beautiful babies. Be careful. Be safe. I'm out of here.